What up, group group? Welcome to Alliance Watch Season 36, War number, not number two, <laughs> because this is still off season. Because, as you know, the Season 36 was postponed because there were issues with the global defender tactic. And yeah, so just a quick rush to get into this war because there's a lot of deaths and just a lot of messing around and testing because I don't test these champs often. So I am fighting with Kitty Pride and Tigra, and I have White Magneto also. The global band detectives are actually working, finally. Um, but there's no conduit, so no defender tactic that we get to test. There is actually Mystic Dispersion from last season. So I'm kind of pissed about that because I'm like, there's no attacker tactic for Mystic Dispersion. So that's so much BS. They didn't give us the same attacker tactic. So it's just, it's just a lot harder of a war and just, we die a lot, especially me. <laughs> but I was actually going to take this fight with Kitty. At first, and actually with Tiger also, but I'm like, no, let's get more charges for white mags just because I want more persistent charges so I can use more pre fights. So I'm like, you know what? It should be an easy fight. Put a pre fight on Nihilus and just parry heavy, throw specials, bait his specials if I can. He's gonna throw a special one in a second, I believe. Right here, special one or whatever. There it is. I'm gonna dash back and I'm gonna attack into it and throw a special two. Gonna see what damage I can do. Oh no. I'm obliterated. What do I do? Nothing. No, I can't do anything. <laughs> so attack, boom, no crits. It's about 20,000 total special two. I wish it did more, but um, yeah, it's DJ in game, which is nice. I'm not sure why it's not, I think because I armor broke him. I'm not sure why it's not bleeding him, but look at that 27,000 special one. More than a special two. I hate when that happens when special ones hit harder than special twos. I should have bathed special ones, but it's the only white mags fight I, I wanted to take. Um, so. I took a special two to the block. Do a nice combo. Special one and dead. 37,000. Boom. Uh, thank you for the crit mastery <laughs> there. Not mastery, but the node that if you do the same attack finisher in a row, you get next hit is a guaranteed crit. So that was nice. Um, because some nice specials. And now this maw. So last war, I took a maw on the node before. Um, <laughs> this is Evan Flow Knockdown. The issue here is right back at it. Because when you knock him down, he goes debuff immune. I'm here. Ugh, I wasn't talking to you, Siri. Gosh, I hate when that happens. Um, but he goes debuff immune, which means that all my ruptures when I knock him down or I counter his heavy, they go away. So this is just a terrible node for Tigra. And I learned that right here. But watch. This is what I hate the most. Resist, resist, triple resist. Triple resist. That is insane, man. And all the ruptures are gone. Uh, it's just not good. This is not a good matchup. And with Mixed Dispersion, triple resist again. But watch here. I have a Dexterity buff and I have an Unblockable buff. And boom. Because the buff goes away with Mystic Dispersion, I miss. I falter. So, Tigra is not good for Mystic Dispersion because of the fact that your Unblockable buff will just disappear. And again, all the ruptures are gone. So, this is just not a good matchup. But... By the time I finished this match and I died, I'm like, you know what? Screw it. <laughs> I'm just going to take this fight down. I don't care about wasting revives. Boom. Unblockable. Cool. Mythic Dispersion happens. I see it's happening. I couldn't run in there and do a heavy attack. It's just, I, I didn't know how to do this fight with Tigra. I knew that dealing ruptures was not the right idea to do it. But I just wanted to keep knocking him down because that's just the way I play with Tigra. Watch this. Another triple resist coming. It's going to come at some time. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm doing decent damage. I'm getting him down. I just can't miss anymore, or else I'm screwed. Um, resist right there, but luckily the other hits didn't resist. Resist, resist, triple resist, and kills me. So, good job of standing your ground. That's pretty awesome. Um, I'm not sure if I would, after I try and do heavy attack counters, if I would trust that in the future, um, in future wars, that if I get resisted, I just have to trust that I'll always be resisted. Um, so that wasn't very pretty. I'm reviving up again because why not? Um, I want to take this fight. I should have had someone else practice this fight, but I really want to get to that Mordo on node 23. I really want to practice it with Kitty. Um, really bad. I've seen other people do it and I really wanted to try it. Uh, but to be honest, my heavy counter is really strong. Like I'm doing a good job countering Maul. Um, and I, I suffer right there <laughs> as I say that. Doing a good job countering Maul as I get destroyed right there. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. Um, but yeah, gotta watch out for that fury buff. 
got nullified. Therefore, because it got nullified in Special 1, Mystic Dispersion occurred, which isn't the freaking global anymore. <sighs> so, I died. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm just annoyed they gave us this global and not gave us... Because if, if so, I would have brought in a third um, attacker instead of White Mags to take down these fights. I could have brought an I bomb for these fights. Could have brought Mr. Fantastic for these fights. But I can't bring him because it's just not... It doesn't work. But yeah, two deaths to this mall. Um, we're just trying to clear the um, the paths. I think last war was, was beautiful with no deaths from me. But I don't really care. And yeah, that counter was not very good. Three deaths to this fight. And I quit. <laughs> Alright, so I really want to get to this fight right here. Um, I put on the White Max free fight already. And... The goal here is just only to be of light because um, of Mixed Master. If I do more than medium light, then um, he'll evade. But as long as I am, um, as long as I'm phasing during the evade, it's not an issue at all. Like right there, he, he, he astral evaded and I was phasing. It's okay. Again, same thing there. Astral evaded, I'm phasing. So this is a very good counter. Oh man, Mr. Dispersion has occurred. I don't know what happened. Maybe I had a. Maybe I had a. Um, what was it? I had a dexterity that I nullified. But yeah, I'm not going to throw any specials here. Uh, I think with suicides and with max boosts, this could have been a very good fight. Could have been over by now already with the special. But yeah, I'm just playing it safe. I'm trying to make sure my dashback goes far enough back so that I can get my phase. Because if I don't go far enough back, you won't phase. And. I mean, you st might still get your intercept, but you just got to be very careful. Um, and yeah, it's a very safe fight. Look at this. I'm at 97%. I don't even know where I lost the 3% from. Um, I think it was a parry at the beginning of the fight just to get my prowess up. Um, but yeah, 10%. And I think I threw a special hero on phase. He's done. 97%. Super easy fight. Even if you threw a special 3, I'm not worried. Um, again, super boosted. I could have taking this fight down in a minute less than this but yeah very easy to fight i hope that i am assigned this fight in the future with tiger synergy um someone else took that fight down or tried to they lost 2000 health that so wasn't a full solo but i'm gonna call it a solo because i mean that special three would have done the extra two percent easily um they tried with archangel without white max free fight and not a very good matchup um but yeah now I have this blade in path 7. I figured I would take path 7 because it's a fun path to take. And I saw a, um, a thing I wanted to use Tigra for and practice that fight. Because um, I'm really practicing my Tigra fighting. So I really want to try um, using Tigra in... I really want to actually bring up Tigra to rank 4 in the future. But I have to make sure that I am good at fighting with her before I bring it to rank 4. Because if I bring it to rank 4, that means I'm trying to sign. But watch this. This is so dumb. I try and dash in here. It didn't work. I try to dash into the special, so I lose some health there. Not a big deal at all. Um, try to repair there. It didn't work. Again, not a big deal at all. Um, try to get my prowess back up again if I can. Um, and yeah, I get my prowess back up to three so I can phase again. I was hoping I get my prowess back up higher, but because I don't have the white max prefect in this fight, it's going to take a lot longer. Their prowess is over 10 now. Good to go. Um, if he misses, it's good, but I have the unblockable buff. And it's a passive unblockable, so it doesn't count towards um doesn't count towards the spike node here. And phase here, special three. Not even needed, but easy fight. Um I really want to phase a special two. I just took a dash back a little too late there. I tried to dash in and the dash in didn't count. Cause that would have been a really nice phase. He would it would have a lot of damage. Um with every single hit that was in a special two. Uh, but it didn't kill me, not a big deal. Again, boosted, that fight would have been down a lot quicker. Now I'm going into this fight with like no health at all. Because I'm not using any potions, just revives, because it's one loyalty each. Um, <laughs> if I use like four loyalty this this war. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to push him back. I'm trying to bait special one if I can. Um, I want to counter special one with, with a heavy attack. Perfect, got some rushers on him. Now this is connect transference and aspect evolution. So I gotta be very careful. Up oh, and he had, I think, he had fourteen rock stacks there, or fifteen. And the rupture didn't apply yet, so it wasn't very safe. Um, again, if I was in a real war, I would have fully potioned up, and I would have taken those hits to the face and been fine, to be honest. Um, because the rupture would have just gotten me back on track. Um, 
but it's not it's not the ruptures it's the neutralize my apologies neutralize what got me back on track um and with the kitty synergy the neutralize lasts a little bit longer man i wish intercepts counted for neutralize but doesn't <laughs> um miss that not not very happy with that but not a big deal is that 15 rock stacks um i'm gonna bait special ones unblockable oh no um can't believe i missed that heavy attack counter earlier my my um My senses are kind of going away now. Right here, I throw a special two with my senses still up. Um, I want to do some big damage. I do some decent damage. He's at 15 rock stacks, so perfectly timed. Trying to bait special two. Will he throw it? Or will I die? He throws it. Cool. I'm going to counter with the heavy attack. My senses are gone. Kind of sad about that, but not a big deal. Throw a special one to get some senses back. I kind of should have waited there. But not a big deal. Throw a light attack to get some better spacing. I think we'll do a parry here. Just to get some spacing back in the corner. Um, but yeah, right here, uh, he's at 16 rock stacks. Awesome. Unblockable. Thought I almost got hit there in the face. I didn't. Special one. Let's try and dodge it. Cool. Light attack to get some better spacing. Cool. Have a special one. I'm going to run in here and do an unblockable. Also, I'm going to do a heavy attack counter here. Resist, but it's okay. Another one. Uh, I guess not. Because I think he resisted. I just want to be safe. So it's, it's going okay. I started at 40% health. Um... And honestly, this fight could have gone a lot better. And boom. Not sure what happened there. I thought I had neutralized up, but I guess I didn't. Uh, maybe I turned it off with the Aspect of Evolution. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure I hit the Heavy Attack at 13 rock stacks. But yeah, I died. Um, I'm going to clean up. Um, this is a rank 3 thing, I think. I'm not sure. Whatever you saw is what you saw. It's either rank 3 or rank, rank 4 thing. Um, Connor is heavy with my heavy. Awesome. And I'm going to finish this off. I'm not going to die again. <laughs> I already died twice to this node. Um, and it's funny because I'm just going to die a lot this war. And it's fun. Because um, it's off season. It's the best time I die is in off season. I lost my senses already. Um, I think I'm sick 100 tiger. Boom. Going to throw a heavy attack right here, I think. Nice. He runs in. He throws a special right, right on time. Um, but yeah. If I was sick 200, I think I would have kept my senses a lot better there. 13 rock stacks, trying to be careful. Uh, throw a combo into him. He throws a special. And do I throw a heavy attack? Yeah, because I got my neutralize up. Awesome. Uh, throw another special, just get another. And look, he's just going down so quickly, and he's done. So I want to get my senses back up again. But if I was sick 200, my senses would have lasted a lot longer. Um, ignore that bing. I don't know what that was. Just kidding. Uh, but I mainly brought Kitty from the Mordo and this Mephisto. So I know Kitty's really good for these fights. Um... If this was a actual in-season war, I would have boosted up, had suicides on, and it would have been a lot easier and potioned up too. It wouldn't be at 40%. My goal here is get some intercepts so I can get some at least 10 prowess so I can be unblockable. Um, I think I get very brave here. So there's my intercept. I'm at three, so now I can phase. Luckily, um, she is incinerate immune, and when she's immune to incinerate, um, she gains some... Um, of her temperature, but temperature is pointless because you can't throw specials in this fight. Um, but yeah, doing pretty well here. Um, I'm unblockable with the Tiger Synergy. It's really nice. I'm dashing in here at the special ones. My leader, Demps, actually told me that you want to dash in during the special ones because you do some nice damage, the phase damage, which is a really smart idea. I'm like, why don't you just dodge it? Um, but yeah, lucky he's not a Mystic Dispersion defender. Um, if he was, I'd be so pissed because it just... I'd be missing everywhere. But yeah, I'm doing some really good damage here. Um, my prowess doesn't matter as long as I'm above 10. Um, baiting special ones. And you'll see this fight goes a little bit sideways at the end. But if I was boosted and suicides, this fight would be over already. And yeah, so I'm at 41% health. I've lost no health. He's at a special two. I'm going to try and bait it out um, if I can. Luckily, there's no brute force here, so I can just bait the special all I want, but he's just not throwing it. I might dash in in a second. No, I don't. Okay, cool. I should have dashed in right here and dash in during that, but he regens. Awesome. So his regen happened. I'm going to bait his special two again, I guess. Awesome. I should have dashed in there early. I should have, so it would have missed, but I didn't. Um, but yeah, he has two auras I'm sending right up. I'm trying my best to bait special and he's at a special three. So I should have just bait special ones. I was trying to dash in here and I didn't work. So I died to a special three because I have no health. Um, and yeah, like I said, this fight would have been so easy with boosts. Um, he's at 17% with no suicides and no boosts at all. 
and I didn't potion up at all. So yeah, I died. I revived up. I'm going to take this fight, and it should be a really easy fight to finish. I did put White Max pre-fight here because, as you see, I have six pre-fights left, and I have all the pre-fights. So I'm going to put a pre-fight on the next fight, that Penny. I really want to practice that Penny also with Kitty Pride, so we'll see how that goes. Also, um, I've seen a few people take that fight before. He regens. Cool. Do I die here? I'm trying to remember if I die again. I don't think I do. I do. Cool. So I died twice in this fight because that intercept did not work. Um, I was a bit pissed off about that, to be honest, if I recall. Um, but yeah, revive up again. <laughs> Man, all these revives. I've used eight revives this war, I think. Or seven. One of the two. Um, or six. I don't remember. Um, died three to that mall. I died um, twice to that thing. I've died now twice to this fight. So if math is correct, that's six or seven deaths. Um, I got my prowess. Awesome. But I need 10 per hour to go unblockable. Um, yeah, so just, he's basically dead. Again, with suicides and everything in this fight, we've been so quickly over. And he throws a special one. I'm going to dash in here. It's a special one, and he's dead. Awesome. So good hint from my leader, Depths, to dash into the special one. Um, he ha also has a rank four kitty that he plays in war. He does a good job with it. Now, the next fight is kitty versus Penny. Um, if I got the correct, I think it's the seventh fight, I hope. <laughs> Um, but mainly you want to get to 10 prowess and just keep it. Um, you want to bait her especially one if you can. Um, I did a parry there just to get my prowess up quicker. I do another parry here, but it won't count because of this orient. Hard knock like, hard knock life. But I get some intercepts off. Awesome. I'm at 10 prowess. I'm now unblockable anytime that I am phasing. So I want to only hit it when I'm phased so that she doesn't auto block me. Um, and that's just the goal here. I made special one. There is brute force here, but with the unblockable, it's really easy to not even bother with it. With suicides and with boosts, I would have thrown a special two here with 20 prowess. Super easy. Maybe would have rushed in here to her hit and gotten hit there. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a very easy fight, to be honest. Just stay unblockable. Um, I believe my officer no good wanted to see. Um, right there, I hit her when I wasn't phasing, so it did a power burn, so can't do that. Can only hit her when you're phasing. Um... Because she can auto-block all you want, but you're, you're unblockable. So, kind of hard to auto-block unblockable attacks. Um, she, she's power-burning me, but not an issue because I am just going to phase most of that power-burn damage. Not a big deal. Um, I don't remember pairing her, so <laughs> I got a Disorient on me. Uh, not a big deal. Just hitting her when I am phased. And as you see here, I'm going to try and bait special 2. And I'm, I'm just hitting her, to be honest. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't even remember what her special 3 does. So... Before a war fight in season, I would normally learn all the specials, see what they do to see if I do phase a special three, what would happen. Um, but I threw a special three here so I can phase her special three. Um, she throws it right away. Um, awesome. So I'll take no damage because I am phasing from my special three. Um, not very smart of me to throw a special because I want to keep my unblockable and after you throw a special, all the prowess go away. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to phase this and have her hit me. Um, but not sure why I parried that, and I'm getting power burned. So I'm trying to get my intercepts back. It's not working, and I am just going to die right here. Um, so power burn got me. a degen from Brute Force from that people hit her. And if I kept my unblockable, it would have been an easy fight, and those are my fights for this war. So I don't even bother going back in in case someone else wanted to practice that fight with someone else. Um, yeah, seven fights, seven deaths. <laughs> uh, war season zero and zero. We did win this war because they gave us the win. I think they wanted their war rating to go down. Um, they didn't even bother finishing the bosses. They only finished one boss, and they had all these champions there to take the bosses down. But we got two bosses down to their one. Um, we've never not finished the map before in off season, so I don't know what happened. Um, but we have one more off season to go, and then we have season if it starts. I'm not sure if we get conduit or if we get Mystic Dispersion again. I'll be so pissed if we get Mystic Dispersion again because they didn't give us the global. They attack a global. Um, but yeah, this is a fun death war. I'm sure that my alliance is going to look at me and be like, yeah, we are not assigning you Kitty. We're not assigning you Tigra. Um, you do not get these fights because you died all in these offseason. So if you want me to prove myself, just let me know. I will boost up in these offseason wars. I'll show you that these fights are super easy in offseason. Um, boost it up. Um, it's just hard to tell because the defenders might have suicides and you can't tell when a defender has suicides whether the fight is good or not. Um, but just... Please, officers, let me know if you're at this point. Um, if you want me to test out these fights fully boosted to show you that I can do these fights with Tigra and Kitty, I'll do it. I have I have boosts. I have loyalty. 
Um, but yeah, I was having some fun testing fights out, dying. It's fun to die in off season because you can't die in season. Um, but anyways, thank you for coming to this video. Coop, sign off. Happy gaming.